Hello guys, welcome back to Tell We How channel on YouTube and in today's tutorial I'm gonna teach you how to create Australia Apple ID account. Well a lot of people came across the internet and searched for several country ID account of Apple and last time I made a, few, a, a video about American account, American ID account and in today's tutorial I will start again with the new version of Australia ID account so let's let's get started first of all you must have the iTunes install on your machine both if you're on Mac you will have automatically install iTunes if you have it on window you must go ahead into the Apple website and then download the iTunes and then install it on your machine. So once you have your iTunes installed, go ahead into the App Store, the App Store where you can download Apple app, Apple iPad or iPhone app. And once you land on the App Store page, scroll it down, scroll it down here and you can see that at the bottom of the page there is a flag, a flag image which is might show differently according to the country that you are right now in for for example in this video we're gonna make it for Australia account so go ahead and click on the flag and it will direct us into another page which show a lot of country flag so because we are wanted to create an Australia account then we might have to choose an Australia so let's find one in Asia, you, there it is in Asia Pacific. In Asia Pacific group, click on Australia. So once you have London, Australia, wait a minute, it's gonna load. Kinda, you know, sometimes it might be slow as it changed. It try to change the server between the country or two country, so it's gonna be a little bit slow. Now we wait for the chain. So again, there are a lot of app that support specific country. For example, you could find a lot of app from Cambodia, but cannot find it in Australia account or even American account, or some app that support only Australia, but the rest of the world can't be supported. So now we almost there. We are directed in App Store Australia account. Seen here it's been downloaded. I'm not sure what download. Snow and Stella. Okay, it was last time that I downloaded the Snow and Stella. I haven't finished download it yet. So now we are landing on Australia. So here we can see that we are, we are officially changed it to Australia account. I mean Australia server of Apple App Store. So go ahead and choose any app that is free to download. For example, the Cookie Cat Pop. Here is the, oh, oh yeah, or maybe WWE. This might be free, as in here it's show two ninety nine. It might be cost some money, but for here it might be free. So go ahead and click on the WWE Champion in here. It might be free to download. It's not about only game. It may be. It, it can only work on both entertainment app or any kind of app that is free so go ahead and freely choose any kind of free app to download but as I think maybe I have my account install no I don't have my account signing in I have free sign in account in here <clears throat> so here we have we landed on the page I mean the app that we are about to download so go ahead and click on get 
So now you can see it pop again. If you have already registered, just sign in your password. If you haven't yet have an account, go ahead and click on create new Apple ID. So it is now directed us into the sign up page. So now here we are in the sign sign up page. Click on continue and click on X7 here. Trust me, you don't really want to read a tons of text in here. Go ahead and click agree. So again, just type it in an email. So I have my email in here. It might be this email s dot adam ninety three. So you got it s dot adam ninety three at yahoo dot com. Another one with password. Gotta make it secretly. Type it in. Okay, so choose the security question. What was the name of your best friend as to nature? I put it as my friend. I choose it randomly as Bent. And what is your dream job? I would put the same as last time because I'm now doing electronic engineer. And another one is the name of your first manager. My first manager is called Jing, so I put it Jing like that. So now enter the date of birth. Well, I better put a rescue email like that. So I, if I have lost my password, I can easily recover it by sending an email into a recovery email into my email that I have put in right here. So now I choose this randomly as well. <clears throat> like 1997 like that and actually that I born in 1997 so we have nothing now you all fill and click continue so here we can see that in payment type there is a function called NUNT remember if you don't click on free app and register you won't see this none button. You only see this three Visa card, Mastercard, and American Pay like, like that in here, but no none button. But if you have click on free free app, it will show up a none button in here. So redeem code, we don't have put a redeem. We don't have to put a redeem code. So just put in title called Mister James Adam. Just randomly, it's not my name and the address just put it Sydney who know uh, New South Wales New South Wales post code oh postcode is important go ahead and search for state in New South Wales state so because we choose the new South Wales state of Australia, so the postal code must be the same, must be one of the new South Wales postal code. So go ahead and search for new South Wales postal code. Bing.com. Let's see new South Wales postal code. Postal code. So go ahead into Google or Bing.com and search for a postal code of New South Wales. So I'll click on New South Wales postal code in here. Or maybe right here, 2000. Postal code of Sydney is 2000. Let's try that. I'll put it like 2000 city of Sydney, Australia. And then the area code. We need the phone number or an area code. Oh, let's search for Australia. Australia 
call code. It, it may be known as calling code. Country code, calling code, city code, telephone number in Australia, Australia code in Australia, area code. Let's search in here. Country code 61 country. So it must be plus 61 in here. You can see that the Australian country code 61 country code. So let's try to type it in with 61 and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And we've been fill it all. Let's click create Apple ID to see it work or not. If it's not working, it will showing that we have some part that is not perfectly or correctly filled but now we can see that the word verify your Apple ID a verification email has been sent to as dot adam93 at yahoo.com so which which is mean that we have successfully registered but not yet successfully registered we have to go into another step is called a verification step so click on OK and then go ahead and check inside your email it's in my inbox let's see inbox here we go we have an apple verify your apple id so click on it and there is a word in here called verify you don't need to read all of this just click on verify so here we have the email and the password so type in the password to finish verification your verification okay so click on continue verification email so now it show that the email address ver ver verified has been verified so we are done click on done and it will direct us into iTunes here's it said connecting to the iTunes store so showing up if we don't have any iTunes it will direct us into this page and let us download the iTunes but we already have one so here we land on the iTunes again and click on OK so we can verify click again on OK so it's been working right now here we go we are in right now so choose app store again go to app store and try to sign in or download any app for example the value the value champion you click on get type in your password to see whether it is correctly registered and then click buy now it accessing iTunes store to get the information of your Apple ID and the server of the Australia account most of the time that when you start the first download it didn't show up so it's not a problem so try it again try it again and you get it successfully installed so again let me try to download the value the value because I, I didn't get the problem too I didn't get why it happened like this but most of the time the first time of downloading is not successfully downloaded so go ahead and try it a second time it's accessing iTunes store again still accessing iTunes store
but believe me when you have already verified it means you already finished the installation here in this step I just want to only prove you that the app and the account is completely work so here we go it asking us for password requirement for the next time we download so if you are familiar if you would like to require after every 15 minutes like that you can click on here but if you want to say to always require the password every time you download every time you selected the app to download so for me I would like to select on always require and it will start downloading here so here we have the WWE 56.9 MB download so here guy your Australia Apple ID account have successfully registered and I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you don't forget to subscribe and goodbye